It's Michelle Visage, and I'm gonna show you what's in the bag. I wear glasses all the time. I feel like glasses are accessories for the face, and I always have a spare pair of glasses. Today I'm wearing vintage Gianfranco Ferre, but I have Gucci here. Yes, they have prescription. No, they're not just a fashion statement. They're both functional and fashionable. So I always travel with a pair of spare hoops, silver and gold. I'm a child of the 80s. I grew up in the 80s, so I always have a scrunchie. And it has to be black velvet because it matches in with my hair. Hello, who could wear a neon green one? One of my travel essentials I cannot live without. Arrow words. We cannot get these in America. So when I am here, I buy every one that I can find. All of them. This is a travel essential because how many movies can you watch on an 11 and a half hour flight from Los Angeles? must have. Another travel essential, and I'll do this on the plane, are masks. But because I'm a woman of a certain age, I'm 51, the neck is always completely ignored. This mask by 111 Skin is a face mask and a neck and chest mask. So I will look like Silence of the Lambs on the plane, and I don't care because I'll have it on my face, on my neck, and I'll just sit there. And the flight attendants come by and do not disturb me, so it's actually perfect. I think one item everybody should have in their bag is a breath freshener of some sort, whether it's gum, a mint, something, to always make sure that I'm not going to be the offender. I'm just the offendee. That's all right. So I always have like a hand warmer. <laughs> These are little disposable hand warmers, but they're cute. These are amazing. They're really moist, and they keep your skin really hydrated, and they take the makeup off. Another beauty essential that I cannot live without, the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Eye Rescue. If you're watching this and you're 16, start using eye cream now. Also, this is always in my bag. How many times have you been in a situation where you've taken a picture and you have food in your teeth? There was a big model in the 2000s called Josie Marin, and she started a line of cosmetics based on argan oil. And her foundation, her vibrancy foundation, is so dewy and so beautiful, medium coverage, not full coverage, but it's so natural looking and you can build on it. I don't go anywhere without Josie Marin Vibrancy Foundation. I wear eyelashes. And I know this is gonna sound crazy and this is a drag queen trick, but I use the 30 second weave bond. I know doctors out there might be going, you're putting weave bond on your eye. Yes, I am. The end. I love the Charlotte Tilbury Collagen Lip Bath. It's really moisturizing, so it fills you out and you feel really good. City Lips is another company that I have like 10 of their plumpers. I don't go anywhere without Mac Cherry. Now, this is controversial. Max Stone has been my best friend for 20 years. I will never leave you, Max Stone. I'm from New Jersey, which is the Liverpool of the UK. And I say, liquid liner is the one thing I couldn't live without. It's liquid with a brush. And also, my other deserted island necessity, nail glue. If I could fit one person in my bag, it would be my dog, because I can't, my husband, my kids, you know, the drama that comes along. I love my family more than anything, but my dog is just fine. And my 17 year old, she loves her candles, her tapestries. She's like what you would call a tumbler kid. And she got me these crystals to travel with and meditate with. I fly a lot. This is called altitude oil. When you're flying and you're feeling, you know, just a little, eh, you just kind of, God, it's like heaven. wear by the stuff and it smells like heaven. This is a travel poopery. You guys know what poopery is, especially in the airplane. It's so obvious when you go in to do what you gotta do. If you use the travel size poopery, that can take care of any of that like oops moments. So I always travel with that. You're welcome, whoever comes in after me. Okay, British Vogue, that's what's in the bag. So I'm gonna pack up and get out of here. Hi, British Vogue. Thank you so much for having me.